It's opening day at Chet's Blueberry Farm in Stevens Point, and this season they have the largest crop of berries in the farm's history. New Channel 7's Sloan Wick went to the farm to see just how many berries there are and why this season was so bountiful. Behind me are 12 acres and over 15 different types of blueberries. Sir, much appreciated. Chet's Blueberry Farm is home to a staggering 14,000 blueberry plants, and the plants are producing more berries than ever this year. The farm owner says he wasn't expecting this big of a harvest, but the weather helped set him up for it. Winter was very mild, and uh, which really helped, and the spring was very good also. So with the warm weather, it really made him pop. The farm spends the entire year making sure the plants stay healthy and don't ripen too soon. They do this through things like underground drip pipes and overhead sprinklers. If it's all blue with the white coating, that is a ripe berry. Blueberries are extremely difficult to grow in this area, making Chet's one of the only local suppliers. Oregon and Michigan typically have the better climate than what we do in central Wisconsin. That's why you will find very few blueberry farms. Um, they are very, very um, fussy. Uh, they need a high pH balance. For many, blueberry picking at Chet's has become a tradition. Ashley Oswald's grandparents took her to the farm when she was a child. Now she brings her own child to the fields. I came last year while I was pregnant with him quite a few times and was really looking forward to being able to finally bring him this year. So I'm glad to kind of continue that tradition um, and looking forward to, to doing that with future kiddos. For Chet's, the picking season will end in late August or early September. In Stevens Point, I'm Sloan Wick, News Channel 7.